And the first thing they notice is some water roiling on, on the ocean. And so Dave decides, being, being the, the kind of pilot that he is, he's going to go in and take a look at this. So he conducts a, a very, very evasive maneuver to get down and close uh, to what he describes as this white, looks like a tic-tac, literally like the, like the breath mint. And it's uh, about 40 feet long. There's no windows, no, no real wings or control surfaces, no obvious signs of propulsion. And yet this object is witnessed now by four separate individuals and two separate aircraft. Craft, um, bouncing back and forth almost like a ping pong ball right over the surface of the water. So as he goes down and, and to take a closer look at this, all of a sudden this thing begins to react to Commander Fravor's uh, evasive maneuvers. And, and really, as, as Commander Fravor's coming in for a better look, this thing begins to maintain its distance and almost uh, parlay, if you will, uh, and keep a distance from, from this aircraft. Um, so that tells us, first of all, it's intelligently controlled. And so as he decides this time, okay, I, I'm, not getting, I'm not getting anywhere here. I'm just gonna go aggressively and go for this thing. Full throttle goes in and, uh, if you will, for that quote unquote kill uh, to see what this thing is. And all of a sudden, like that, it's gone. It absolutely disappears over the horizon with, within, within about a second. Now, what's even more scary, which is in about five seconds afterwards, and we, we know this conclusively, we did the investigation. This object now is picked up once again on radar 60 miles away. Please subscribe to our channel.